Apparently, Misa being the Spear King was not a surprise for many people that actually pay attention and focus on the plot. Okay, let me just to defend myself. When you guys watch anime, you can sit there, sit back, and enjoy the show while focusing on the plot. For me, when I'm trying to react and commentate, shit's a bit different. Not only do I have to pay attention and try to read the subtitles or trying to talk and try to react and try to give an, like, an entertaining time, a lot of this information just goes through my head and I have no idea what's happening. But I would argue, me being ignorant of the plot, me not being aware, actually makes better for reaction because I start popping off for, I guess, little things such as Misa becoming the Spirit King that everybody should have known, and it's better for entertainment value. Let's begin the reaction. Misa, how could you do this? Damn, that new hair goes hard, though. And that new, new purple lipstick. Oh, I like this, Misa. Ooh. Temporary form. So this is the true Abos. But I cannot, can we really trust this? What if she's like also being mind controlled by some higher being? I don't know, man. Can you? I don't know. I don't think anyone could, though. Man, Misa's new form, though. Oh, I, I, oh, oh, this is actually looking really nice. Oh, uh, sure, sure. I'm just acting like I know what's going on. Yes, yes, of course. Yes, yes. Then again, if we have Anos' sword, can't we just, like, change all this, like, reality as we know it and just overrule? Bro, hey, how dare you call him a fool? None of that really does anything, though. Has he, though? I don't think so. Like, I until the real demon king. So we oh, I thought we were gonna fight right now, but okay. I'm just gonna show up and leave. I don't think this shit matters. Can't we just bust out of this? But bro, you're really gonna take this class to the end. It's never gonna end. Then I'll just finish it. I'll just break it. Forbidden. Says who? Unless it's like a godly order. <laughs> I don't care, dude. I'll just break out. Uh, I don't think it really matters to Anos, right? Like, come on. How are you surprised now? Let's go, guys. Bye. <laughs> no, you have to finish taking my class. Come on. Subordinates. Okay. So he's on our side. Or no, not really. What the f Okay. Oh. <laughs> it's him again. Yo. I like this guy. He was a he was a bro last episode. Again, let me take it from here. That's what he did the last episode too. Here, go on. I'll help you out, buddy. I like the King of Curses. It's such a sinden. It's not like I want to help you or anything. Bye bye. <laughs> I'm so immature. He keeps like TT. <laughs> Of course we can, right? Overrule that. Protect the mom first. The flower is like shriveling. No. Come on, TTs. Okay, it's just a secret. And we're out. I wonder where the spirit, uh, the, the heavenly father is. Because the heavenly father... <laughs> Was, all he was doing is smirking and standing around last episode, too. How does he play into this? She has to be involved. Of course, she, she's the mom. Or perhaps... Perhaps? Okay. Because she supposedly have died, but she came back and she lost her memories and I don't know anymore. According to lore. How do we break that lore? I don't know. All these rumors and lores are so, so absolute. The Heavenly Father. The Heavenly Father's orders? If the Heavenly Father says Anos is the real one, then it's all fine? I, I don't know how this shit works. <gasps> no, Mom and Dad! No! They're gonna be fine, right? There's no way they get in danger, right? Please, please. Or maybe if they will, Anos will show up at the last second and just save them. Who is this girl? I've been seeing her sneak around before, too. Who is she? Am I supposed to know her? Probably just another... Wait, wait, wait! This is Amelia! Is this sensei Amelia that turned into a... Oh my god! No! 
<laughs> Wait, that's, now she's gonna get hunted down for not being a royal. Oh shit. Dude, I completely forgot about her because we haven't seen her after that. Now, I kind of feel bad now. Before I was like, get fucked, Amelia. How do you like that? You're not a royal anymore. And I would be all for the torture, but now I'm like, kind of conflicted. I, uh, uh, I, I, wanted, I wanted her to suffer, but it's been such a long time now. I'm just like, leave her alone. Oh. Someone's got to save her. No, no. Someone save her, please. Oh, shit. Her power's actually getting taken. Anos. And this is exactly how Emilia would be talking in the past before she changed to a hybrid. I should be like popping off that she's suffering like this, but it's been so long and I've all my like desire for vengeance against Amelia is gone. This is kind of fucked. But she's really learning. What do you mean, why are you doing this to me? This is exactly how you behaved before. In fact, if she was still a royal, a pure blood royal, wouldn't she do the same thing to a hybrid? Yeah, this is important for her. Like, this is actually a really important lesson. I can't believe she fucking did this against the students, dude. Okay, now that they're reliving the memories of the past of what, all the fucked up things she did, let's torture her. Let's torture her. That was so crazy. But this is also the first time the fan union really just like popped off and was like, respect, respect. I feel kind of bad still. This is an important lesson for her. But I feel still bad. I don't know, man. I don't know. Please, somebody save her. This is actually kind of painful to watch. Anos! Anos? No, mom, don't! But she has to save because she's a good person. I'm not sure if the mom, the mom definitely doesn't realize that this is Amelia, the teacher that tried to kill her before. She definitely knows, but the mom doesn't. Don't! No! Dad? Yeah. Things will be fine, right? Oh, shit. Oh, I'm so worried. Bro. This is the woman you tried to kill before. Now she's saving your ass. Yeah, she, does, she doesn't know about that, right? I don't think she does. I don't think she recognizes. Maybe she does. Mom is such a kind person. You know, this is important character development, though. Oh, Jesus. Thank you, I guess, for saving mom there. No, dad! Uh, Gusta and Isabella, we actually finally get to learn their first names. Anos. Anos. Thank God. Thank God. Bro. This is gonna be good. <laughs> Bro, you should be asking, wait, who was that voice? Huh? <laughs> Here we go. And our entire crew. Limb from limb, you said. We're doing it. Limb from limb. Oh? Yes, absolutely. In the sky. We're gonna actually just tear them apart limb by limb. Yeah, I mean, you were gonna do that. Why are you so surprised? Oh, he won't? Even worse than limb by limb. I would argue this is like a painless death because they died in instantly. If it, limb by limb would have been more painful. I'm kind of fucked for enjoying this, aren't I? Maybe. Come on, that was good revenge. Oh, thank God Mom was okay. I can't believe Amelia is still around. I completely forgot about her. Have you learned your lesson, Amelia? Have you learned your lesson? This is the woman you tried to kill in season one. Have you no shame? Anos knows that's her, right? There's no way he doesn't recognize her, right? Right? <laughs> what are the odds? Wait, wasn't that the teacher that tried to kill us once? You better enjoy mom's homemade soup and snacks. Yeah, we have an entire crew. <laughs> You have so many wives. I'm so proud of you, my son. <laughs> They're the best. I love them so much. We haven't gotten much of them since, like, season one, actually. Huh? Automatically heals the powerless. Automatically heals the powerless. Uh -huh. okay. Remember, you need the castle to draw the, the sword. 
But remember, can't Misha also create her own like pseudo castle? But creating like Misa basically, Misha creates that kind of castle too, the ice one, and then can draw the sword like that too. The door's kind of open. Who's listening? Who is it? It's Amelia, right? It's gotta be Amelia, right? Alright, say something, dude. Satisfied? Not until you admit you're guilted. Fucking redeem yourself right now. I feel like if she turned back, she wouldn't have learned a lesson. No, she's gotta be content with being a hybrid and learn to live a new life. Yeah, and, and then you would die. <laughs> Absolutely not. That's, that's a lesson we're trying to teach you. Yeah, you just always be wanting to be on the ruling side. Now look, you're on the opposite side. How do you feel? It was never about being a pure blood or anything. If she truly learned her lesson, she won't ask. Mm -mm. Did you learn your lesson or not? Mm. Hold. Let her cook. She did after she tried to kill her first, but she did protect her. Oh. Oh, that's a thank you from Anos. I think Amelia learned her lesson. I think she redeemed herself, don't you? Yeah, I think so. Now what? <laughs> Collapses. Learn to live yourself as a hybrid, I guess. Oh, wait, this is the other <laughs> That's all Vesha's. 10,000 of them, right? This is crazy. 10,000 Vesha's all living down here. <laughs> it's kind of cute. It's also kind of like horrifying that they're all just the same. <laughs> For a second, I thought this would be like a pop-off episode where we fight the demon, uh, sorry, the Avo Stilhevia, who's actually half a Misa. But no, the focus of this episode was Amelia out of nowhere. Did you guys forget about her like I did? I completely forgot she existed, even though in season one, my God, I hated her so much. She was so despicable, but I think off of this episode and how she didn't ask to be turned back to royal the way that she protected mom i think she learned her lesson this would be a good redemption for her but hey if you're still around if you enjoyed this reaction please subscribe and check out the other videos and playlists to my channel for even more content and until next time take care